What up guys? Welcome back to another video. Now, this is why I like winter. It's cold enough to make a fire outside cooking at night is one of the favorite things that I like to do. And it's like a little challenge. So today, I'm gonna go ahead and bring you along with one of my little ideas that I'm gonna go ahead and cook a late night steak, big old fat cowboy cut ribeye steak. We're gonna throw it on a grill. And we're gonna use natural wood for this one. And uh, we're gonna cook it nice and slow. Thought I'd bring you guys along. And uh, let me show you the setup. So we're gonna go ahead and use this little tiny grill right here. And this is the log wood I'm gonna use. I don't get too technical on names and certain types. I just kind of use whatever I got around. We're gonna throw it in here. And then we're gonna go ahead and use lighter fluid to light it up. And I got these guys, I got these guys hanging out with me. Candy right there. Titus right here. We're just gonna, they're gonna be hanging out with me tonight out here while we cook this steak. And uh, it's nice, perfect weather. So let me get that fire started. Had to go inside and get the light. But what I think I'm gonna go ahead and do so I'm gonna go ahead and throw this stuff in just like this. And God damn dude. God damn. Over there. I'm gonna go ahead and get this all soaked up first. Do not try this at home, okay? Do not try this at home. Do not play with fire at home. Serious thing, dangerous thing, mess with fire, get burned by fire. Play with fire, burn by fire. Light it like this. The bottom of the log lit throw it in throw it in like that that way it looks so lit i got the fire started i have to go and find the grate for this one. So there you go i think i might have put a little too much of this boy on there but yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and look for that grate so that way we can go ahead and get to cooking because these guys they just want they just want the steak they just want the steak that's all they want they don't even care for me they'll fall they'll follow me everywhere Okay, I think I know where it's at. Um, let me see. I think it's over here inside one of these other barbecues I have. I think it's in here. Um, I got this one. I believe it's that one. Now, I don't think that's good, but we're just gonna have to I'll probably stick some more logs in there. But yeah, this one, it, it, it goes straight up in there so and it's pretty good so throw that big old fat juicy steak on it should be good this one right here. <laughs> hanging out huh okay. i got all this wood put a lot of little ones on the bottom i don't know why but, uh, oh this one right here oh, that's a big too right here look look, look. I found a good one. perfect one to add to the bunch <sighs> So I was wondering why it smelled like dog crap in here. It's <sighs> tempting a big old mile of dog crap right now. Check it out. Damn. That sucks, I guess. Bruh, look at my boot. Yeah. Huh, who did that, huh? Another thing I like to do at night, which is good, is water your grass at night. So I'm just going to throw the timer on. Get the water running, water my grass. Um, it's a little chilly, but you can still water it, you know what I'm saying? Make it nice and healthy. Yeah, so it's starting at the bottom. It's getting nice and hot at the bottom. Hopefully it lights a little better, but. Checking on this fire. And the thing is, is that it is burning good. I don't want to leave it in the steam too long because it starts dropping the ashes and the coals onto the concrete. It's falling to the bottom and uh, we gotta get that, we gotta kinda like, gotta kinda save all that. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw that. I'm gonna go ahead and throw it in the grill already. I don't know where this caterpillar came from. Maybe we should cook him up there too. Maybe we should throw him on the fire. Nah, we'll throw him over there. We are actually gonna go ahead and throw this bad boy on. Go ahead and throw it on. Let all that nasty stuff that's on there burn off check it out this is the steak that i'm preparing to late night cook it's been seasoning for about two days so it's pretty seasoned 
I use this Kinder's Prime Steak Black Garlic Seasoning right here. This is what I use. This stuff's good. Like I said, it's been seasoned for two days. So this is the steak I'm talking about. It's pretty good. It's a... There that bad boy is. Check it out. There it is, cowboy cut ribeye. Seasoned for two days. Go ahead and throw that on there. Look at that. Yeah. Go ahead and we're gonna go shut this. And we'll keep an eye on it. Stay tuned. We are going to go ahead and flip it. Looks like it's cooking nice and good. Go ahead and check this out. It's a nice medium right there. Got the head country barbecue sauce right here. So we're gonna give it a taste test right now. Straight off hot right here. Mmm. 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 The best steak ever. That is crazy that I cooked that like that. On that little grill. Mmm. Best steak ever. I'm getting another piece. Check it out, medium. Nice, juicy, medium. Go ahead and give it another bite. Look how steamy it is. It's cold outside right now. Mmm. 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 It's really good. Like I said, it's always better when you work for things. But uh, I hope you guys enjoyed today's little adventure and today's video. And then don't forget to like, subscribe, and we'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.